Tommy Oldham here, and yes, I'm on another one of my football ground hops. Originally, my plan was to watch Spring Egg, but I've noticed just a mile away, the mill are at home, so I'm going to go watch them as well. It's interesting because the mill is celebrating their city, yeah, yes, 100 years, and they're currently the top of the Manchester League, so it should be a good game. If you've not noticed already, I've uploaded a good few of my vlogs this week. I've got two I still need to upload, which I haven't. Thanks for everyone who's watched them. Like tomorrow, so I've also put a lot of my music vlogs this week. Although the season's over, I've got a lot more stuff to come, including the Euros. Unfortunately, I only managed to get one extra ticket for selecting like Ukraine, so that's four games at the minute. But never give up hope. Let's see what happens. And this is where I'll be walking to on Monday as I go to Spring Edwards round right further along the next the stop George Street is side of the background. Stanford Street. So I'm on a similar buzz route to us, mostly the scenic route, but the weather's not the best today, so there's no need to really necessarily film out there necessarily. The bus is only going as far as Groton, so I need to jump on another one, or it's a mile and a half walk. Unlucky on me. So there's your scenic route of Groton so far, but then again, I think the worst of places to be in. So if you look on here, this is the old Groton railway line, and over there is what's left. Of Groton LA station, an old platform. And here's one of my better rail links than it had now. It used to have three big stations, and it before it became converted into a metro link line, and some of the other stations were lines were shut, the stations demolished. Back on the bus now, the other thing is allow me to adventure to an old issues railway station speed. It's a future video for definite ball. It's too muddy to go along all the way the line, which would have brought me out to Greenfield originally, but that's one for a hot day. Now back to the football. Welcome to Upper Mill. And this along here is a Huddersfield Canal from the Upper Mill part of it. Plenty of wildlife and ducks here as well. A couple of boats also down here. Here's a better one of the River Tame. It runs through West Yorkshire into Oldham, into Lancashire. This is Lancashire water, no matter what you say. Down there. Got to come across here and get another. Go over here, some lovely walks around this area of Oldham. So much almost now, eventually at the ground. Buzz went further on than what I thought it should have done. And here we are, Manchester League. Game. It's a game going on there, I'm not sure who it is. One team's in claret and blue, the was in a black and yellow kit. They both actually look nice, but. Not the game I'm going to, but nicely to have. For a vlog of this field league, and that's more side of seeing the yellows playing. More side. Anyway, local team, come on. And I've now arrived here at Churchill playing field to up the mill. Let's see a plane. Because remember these playing fields so they cross country from the school there. First year I pulled out which on the corner over there. Well no, yeah, first year I did the race for year five. Then year six I completed it came fifteenth at about forty. Children. In true style I've arrived and I found out it's a two o'clock kickoff, not three o'clock, so I missed the first star. Typical me. I finally get to a game one day where it's on time and I won't miss kickoff. Up and healthy into Manchester League. Come on up and milk. Up and in the blue, Hindisford, Hindisford in the red. So it's currently 1 0 to Hindisford away up and mill, you're currently at the top of the league.
Football there at Up and Elfie Hinesford. I'm going to start doing my own channel dedicated just to the dogs at the spot. Out of waiting, the dogs are settled. In, nice finish, well top. Down the ball over there. Good header, nice finish that, good goal. Game on now. His manager was just being shown a red card, he was put in the first half. Here he is now walking off in true football style. Cheerio, cheerio, cheerio. He doesn't look best pleased either. He will get that equalizer that he wants. Switch it wide. Oh, he's on. Scores is like there, Paul Scores, I was giving it. Scott gave us playing City of Liverpool today. Um, Runcon got knocked down. Oh, the semi final. Yeah. Oh. Down to 10 men and the manager just said, I'll run straight. I'll open all the man, and that's why I fancy to make it count. Oh, 
Ten minutes left, apparently. Up in the line, I'll look in a better team, it'll be more dangerous going forward. That's where they can take the chances. Especially with Inter being down to 10 men now. Looks like they've gone three at the back. Five in the middle. Hopefully, we'll don't have any more wee games at home after school. Oh, only away games. Three has gone down now, is he? Enjoys just time waste of it, especially down to 10 men. Try to preserve his sleep. Come to the mill now. Another game over there. It's finished now. I'll try and get the final score later on from the more side FC. Finds the finds with Jordan, let's get a bit nasty now. Tackles are going in a bit hard. Into the start, into panic. Yeah. Keep the right idea, but it's a bit too hard for me. Right back then. Oh, it's not cleared now, it has. He's good, just trying to waste as much time as he can now while they hold on to the lead. See, there have been a few minutes stoppage time still. Let's put up to that for a minute now. Time it's a surprise win that for Hinsford. They were missing the second half, but it was an entertaining second half. A penalty, a goal, a ref sent off, and a other player sent off. Roll next ground up on Monday. Thanks for watching, everyone.